back to our detailed wedding planning board the next thing we're going to cover is how to attach something to a card as you can see some of these cards have attachments so you have this one here it shows you how many attachments are on the card and the little paper clip means you have attached something similarly here you see these paper clips it means it has an attachment uh, let's say creating wedding website does not have an attachment so we'll go ahead in there once you click on a card it opens it up here you have a bunch of options you see attachment is one of them or you can simply click the paper click paper clip and from here you have a bunch of options I love Google Drive uh, you can either attach things from your computer or you can log into your Google Drive and simply attach it from there uh, let's see if my Google Drive shows up here so here's my Google Drive uh, let's say I'm working on Facebook ads let's pick this photo and I can hit select and then I just hit send and it will attach it from my Google Drive straight to this card as easy as that once the attachment is complete you'll be able to see a screenshot of what it looks like and from there on you can either open it in Google Drive remove it or I can even comment on that attachment that's how attachments work again if you hit the little paper clip it's going to bring the same menu up that would if you click on this attachment uh, button right here so I can also attach something from my computer so let's try that too uh, let's pick a picture let's see here's my wife let's attach her photo in here we might need this photo for our wedding website so as you'll see the one attached from my computer shows you the thumbnail image and it also shows up here on the card cover anytime you see an attachment image showing up it is called a card cover you can either leave it as is or if you don't want to see the cover you just click on the card and click on remove cover and that will remove the cover image from the card again you can make any attachment as long as it's an image file a cover image or you can simply remove it so that is how you attach files and that is how you make them cover images or again if you don't want it just simply remove it another cool way to add attachments is to simply copy and paste a link from a website into the attachments box so if you look here there when you click on attachments you have the option to paste any link right here so let's go ahead and do that on Google I've searched for wedding ideas uh, since I'm creating a website I want some inspiration uh, let's say I like this one uh, you click on it and then you just click on view image once you click on view image you're going to be uh, shown the image and you'll also get a URL which is right here so I can copy this URL simply right click copy or control or command C on your keyboard I go to attachments and I just paste it right here and hit attach now that image will be attached to this particular card and there you have it that's how you can attach using links